say, man. Hey, man. This your boy Do It All Hall, and we are back with another NBA 2K24 Next Gen Build video. And today, I have a special 6 foot 10 big body Benz build for you guys. When I say this build can score everywhere on the court, I do mean everywhere, man. We got great finishing on this build. You get contact dunks, you get the big man contact dunks, you get post going on this build. Really high three point shooting, high mid range shooting. You do have great passing on this build to, um, you know, pass the ball to your teammates on time on target. And we do have the defense, the shot blocking, the rebounding, what we need in order to be a small forward slash power forward. So make sure you watch the video to the end so I can show you how I created this masterpiece. Choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. But before I go any further, you already know what time it is. If you don't know, now you know. It's like button time. And I need you guys to go down there, hit that like button, get this video to 100 likes. And if you haven't already hit the link in the description to join the discord so we have a small forward build right here you can go power forward with this build if you want to the reason i went small forward instead of power forward is because they may put you at center if you at, at, at the power forward but i don't want this build to be at center i want it to be at the small small forward or power forward either or okay 236 on the weight 610 on the wingspan let's get into it so we're going to start with the finishing now i want this build to have some contact dunk so i took the driver dunk to an 87 and I took the layup to a 70 along with the standing dunk. We took that to an 83, okay? And we took the post control up a little bit to a 75. So this is what we have up here. And we're gonna come down to the strength and acceleration. I mean, the strength and the um, vertical. And we're gonna get that up a little bit. We wanna make sure we have good enough strength. And we want to have good vertical for certain badges. So we're going to take that up too. Now let's come back up. Let's talk about this uh, finishing. So with the 75 post control, we do get drop stepper. We do get post spin technician. Those two badges right there are really, really good this year. If you are a person that like to play in the post and you like to do post spins and drop steps, this build is for you. We have the 83 standard dunk so we can get rise up on silver along with fast twitch on silver and we get the pro big man contact dunk so that's really really good to help you out at the rim with the 87 driver dunk that's for my people that want the pro contact dunks uh we do have that on this bill and we get post rise on silver along with slithery on silver that's pretty good and the 70 layup i know it's kind of low to some people and you may want to take it up if you want to take it up higher than that go ahead and take it up and the close shot is going to go up to a 54 on its own but uh we're not necessarily worried about having that super high as long as you can finish at the rim and that's and don't real real really will really help you out okay but let's go ahead and get it to the green bean make it a girl screen bad this build does have an 86 three-point shot right i want this build to be a really really good shooter and uh, as it sits you could kind of leave it right here if you want to but i know folks want a uh, gold midi magician or whatnot so i took the mid-range shot up to an 84 so with the 86 three-point shot and the 84 mid-range shot, you can make shots anywhere on the court. So you're not limited to one spot. You're not limited to the corner. You're not limited to the wing, the top of the kit. It does not matter where you shoot from with this build because you have everything that you need. As you can see, we do get limitless range on this build. If you want it on silver, you already know what you got to do. So uh, catch a shooters on gold. Really, really good badge this year. Along with corner specialists, Claymore, uh, things like that. You know, if you want to spot up with this bill, you don't have to be a spot up shooter with this bill because you could dribble and get your own shot. So anytime you want to get to your spot in the mid range or the three, you could do it with this bill. And like I said, the 84 mid range shot is so you guys can have gold mid and magician, which is a really, really good bad this year. Um, you got post fade phenom on gold, so that's good as well. And everything else is pretty much icing on the cake, man. You could do any kind of scoring with this bill okay but let's go ahead and get it to the sauce but before we do i need you guys to do me a huge favor right go down there hit that like button hit that subscribe button hit that share button and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody mama, can see this video and i need everybody mama see the video so do that for your boy boy and i forgot we got that 66 free throw if you think that's too low take it up so with this build of course we got that 87 passing that will help us out when it comes to break starter needle threader uh relay pass a touch pass you get all those bads on this build so any type of pass on the court you will be able to make so look at this build as if it's a point four. you know it, re it really is because you know you got that great passing on this build but you don't have the ball handling the speed with ball like a point forward but you have the passing like a point forward and you can be a point guard for your team you know if y'all need one somebody to uh bring the ball up the court this bill can bring the ball up the court with no problem um you may you know get plucked every now and then but for the most part you still can bring the ball up the court and you can be a great passer for your team 
for the ball handle, we're going to take that up to a 76, and we're going to take the speed with ball to a 67. So let's max both of those out. And as you can see, we do get physical handles on gold. That's really, really good for this build. And we're going to take the speed and acceleration up. And as you can see, we do get triple strike on silver. We get blow by on bronze. We get Hall of Fame big drive on this build. We also get unpluckable on bronze. We get killer combos on bronze. So that's pretty good. And we will get handled for days on this build as well when we take the stamina up. So I think that's pretty good, man. You know, to have certain badges on this build being at six foot ten. And uh, six foot ten is not a bad height at all. I have a six foot ten build myself. The only thing I don't like about it is that you can't get clamps. If I can do anything to change it, that's what I would I would have done. I would have went down to six foot nine on my build and gave it kind of gave it the same stats or try to get close to it. But uh, six ten you can't get clamps, and that's the only bad thing I don't like about six foot ten. But other than that. The build is real, real versatile, man. Can guard any position um, with the exception of that clamps, you know, because, you know, you get on the perimeter with no clamps, it's going to be rough on you if you got somebody in front of you that can dribble. So um, that's the only drawback from this build. But let's go ahead and get into the defense. Now, when you think of a 6'10 build, you think of a, you know, a build that can play in the paint a little bit. You know, you have the small forward position, but you can play small forward and you can get even get at center if you know what you're doing, you know, with this build. So um, I would say this build is really, really versatile, right? So for the interior defense, we're going to get that up to a 72. The reason being is because we have that 80 seven on the block and that's pretty good with the 87 block and the 72 interior defense we do get anchor on silver we get chase down artists on gold and that's really really good in my opinion to have those two badges on this bill you will be able to block some shots no doubt about it now if you want post lockdown on silver i mean on bronze go ahead and take your um, interior defense to a 74 but i think a 72 interior defense is good on any bill okay if you're a center if you're a power forward it does not matter 72 interior defense is good now like i was saying we don't get clamps on this bill but you can't get badges like challenger ankle braces all ball pitch pick dodger but you have to take perimeter defense up but i didn't touch anything on the perimeter defense or the steel so if you guys want that go ahead and take it up on your bill for the offensive rebound, we're going to do an 85 on that so we can get rebound chaser and we have a gold box. So that's pretty good in my opinion to have those two badges on this build so you can get some rebounds and, uh, you know, be able to help your teammates out with the kickouts because you do have a gold break start on this build. As far as the strength, we got a 73 strength, 65 acceleration. We have an 84. What I say as far as the strength? As far as the speed, we got a 73, a 65 acceleration, 84 strength on the build. 80 on the vertical and the rest is on now let's get into these shades of are you ready because guess what i do not clickbait here we go here we go here we go now we do have shades of kiki vanderway okay michael porter jr and we also have franz wagner that's a pretty good comparison right there man we have the diamond three level threat that's the build no matter here man Chach. 